All right, boysies. Oh, sorry, about it. I clicked on the wrong source. How are you doing, boysies? How are you doing? We're coming to you live from the old Man on Home video store, and we're digging back into Pokemon Omega Ruby. How are you doing? I know it's a little me the screen's a little messy, but just wanted to have this screen up just to be like, aye, there's our boys we lost. I'm tired and hungover. Shut up. You have a good night last night. That's why you don't drink, or you drink in moderation. I don't know. Look after yourself, boysies. Oh, my controller seems to have died. This stream is starting off to a great start. What were you drinking last night? What were you on? Was it the old fashions? Old fashioned? I can't talk today. Right, and let me just fake, get rid of There we go. Jack and Cokes. Ah, my old one favourites as well. So, I think you'll remember what I used to do is. I used to go in with 20 quid. 20 quid was like my going out money. And I'd get, like, me and David kept playing drinking games that I'd look, Jesus Christ, Kieran. Do you remember all the times we used to play King's Cup and whatever it's called, uh, Ring of Fire, that we shouldn't do drinking games because they'll always end badly? Uh, but yeah, I used to go with 20 quid and I would get pissed on a couple of vodka cokes and, like, spoons beforehand or whatever. I'd then go in and I'd top myself up with a couple of Sambucas. Sambucas were like a pound in catty. And then to end the night, I'd go, right, I'll get myself a double Jack and Coke, and that'll be my last drink for the night. Can I actually, oh, I thought I could, oh, wait, I can actually just jump up here. Oh. Anyway, boys, we have got goggles. Uh, we, Brendan, gave us goggles last time. So we can head into the desert to have a look. I don't actually know what's in the desert. I don't know what use it is. Not use it is, but you know what I mean? I don't know what. Like, why you need to go in the desert at all? Maybe it's just a shortcut in between these places, but we're just going to have a look in the desert, see if we can... Oh! What drinking games were you playing last night? Here we go, uh... Okay. Rock Blast, let's go. Big Reginald. Fuck! So I don't think Big Reg needs to worry about this wee Sancho. We should be okay. I'm very worried that I didn't like instantly one shot it considering I'm nearly double its fucking uh, level. Oh god. Wait, Reggie, come on, you can survive this, you can take this. Will we catch Sandro? Eh, fuck it, may as well have a backup. Uh, bag, Pokeballs. I've only got one Great Ball left. Hope this does the job. Right, come on, come on, catch him. Catch him. Get in my ball, come on. Yes, man. What are we calling the Sancho? Let's call him... Um, play a game where we'd have to keep naming famous folk and follow up with our famous person's name starts to the last letter of the previous person's name. Oh my god. Sancho's body is config configured to absorb water without waste, enabling it to survive in arid deserts. This Pokemon curls up to protect itself from its enemies. Uh, it does make sense, but fuck me, that sounds like a nightmare. So it'd be like, say if I said... Aubrey, Pl like Aubrey Plaza. You didn't have to choose someone that starts... With an A. So it'd then be... Uh, I forgot everyone's name start Aaron Paul, there we go. So, And then that would go to L, so I'd be like Leslie Nielsen and... Oh god, and is it if you can come up with them in X amount of time, take a drink? We'll call it Kieran. Oh, that's a J. The letter Y fucked me, uh... Oh, I'm not paying attention, Jesus Christ. Kieran, there we go. I got... Yeah. How do you say that name? Yives. There's a few famous Yvonne's. That's oh no, Kieran's getting sent to RIP. And admit that's probably where he feels like he is right now. Does it again does Desert not have much use apart from like catching legendaries and shit? Just give a quick gander through it, see if I can I can't believe I just killed Kieran. He doesn't even have a chance to live. I've got a root fossil. Uh wait. There's a root fossil. 
And there's the claw fossil. I'll take the claw fossil. Don't really care about the root fossil, because root fossil's the tree looking thing, isn't it? I'm not too not too big on these fossil Pokemon. They're okay. They're not as I didn't like the ones in Sword and Shield. I like the idea that it's like you know how scientists used to mix up dinosaurs all the time? That was the gimmick behind them. That was a cool I like the idea of the gimmick. But and I didn't like how they looked, you know. My eyes may sting a bit, but I'll still have a picnic here in the desert. Well, the best fucking uh which got fossil Pokemon is uh Tyrant. Which is the wee T-Rex that appeared in X, I think. Or Pokemon X and Y. Which is fucking class. Oh, Sand Slash. Speaking of class Pokemon, the Ice Sand Slash are really cool as well. Uh, oh fuck, why did the Rock Polish? Right, I think I need to get him a move that's not Rock Blast, because that doesn't really do much. Right. Right, we're okay. Uh... Fuck it, we'll build those. Oh, avoid the attack. Oh no. That's a rock blast. Come on. Okay, maybe this move is absolute shite. Right, we'll trade Reginald out. Uh... Oh yeah, I've leveled up Pika Blue at wait a wee bit. Because I thought I might need a, I need a Water Boy in my team, but I forgot as soon as I was as soon as he got to level twenty, uh, Gyarados learned uh, what's it called? Learned a Water move, so suddenly Pika Blue wasn't needed. But it's alright. So we've now got Pika Blue in our team. Damn it, I sure used. No! Pika Blue! No! Better get Pika Blue hidden away. Nearly getting done by a sand slash, holy shit. I sure just used Bubble Beam, would have probably taken it out. Or being very careful, Pika Blue is surviving. Oh, fuck off with your dig attack. Like, come on, Aqua Dog. Um, it gets up Aqua Tail. No, you wait until it's back up, you prick. Oh, it's okay, it didn't affect anyone, so. Aqua Tail. There we go. Yes, man. Oh, Peekaboo is level 29. Oh, you're mean. Oh, what's this? Oh, Pika Blue's evolving. Yes, man. Big Azum. Is it Azumarill? Was like my main boy when I was playing through Heart Gold, Soul Silver had a level 100. Yes, man. Look at it. It's beautiful. Big Pika Blue. Big beefy boy. Boggin. You know a fan of the Pika Blue? Right, so all I remember is this is where you can get the re Oh, excuse me, I've got really bad wind. This is where you can get the Regis, like Regie Ice, Regie Gigas and all that, and... How did you manage to climb your way up here? Did you use a strange power like me, I wonder? You rode your Mack bike up here? Wasn't some strange power? Do you think I could ride one too? The only good Pokemon is Mewtwo. Uh, Megan finds him really weird because we watched, uh, what's it called? So she watched, uh, as a, even as a kid, she watched Pokemon the movie. I think everyone already did. But then when we watched uh, Detective Pikachu, suddenly he has like this mad fleshy sort of look to him and he looks bogging. To train myself, I challenge everyone I meet. You are challenged by Black Belt Daisuke. Machoke. Oh, fuck. Oh no, you need to be careful because Reginald's uh, weak to this. Mewtwo is the most fuckable Pokemon. Oh god. Dear Jesus. Uh... 
Right, Reggie, come on, you can just, just take him out with a, take him out with a magnitude before he can do anything. Shit. He used wake up slap. Oh my god! Oh my god! Reginald! No! Uh Vengi. Not no Kieran, you go on some certain sites and you will see a lot more Pokemon that are What's up? Yes, I poisoned them. Mike is an expert in those special Pokemon sites. Uh Giga Drain, there we go. Get some get some of our health back. I remember as a kid I really fancied Jesse from uh, Team Rocket. Don't know why. Mikey loves that Jigglypuff Rule 34. Jesus. I, I was going to say there's no way that exists, but I'm not putting it past Pokemon artists that, or, you know, Rule 34 artists. I'm surprised you weren't a Sabrina fan. She actually scared me. Like, I probably should have been in, like, because I like, you know, like my big scary goth girls, but... She actually scared me a bit. I think it was with my whole Exorcist doll thing. And I actually don't know why I'm here, so I'm probably just gonna... I'll fight this archaeologist and we'll head. For 30 years, I have searched for ancient ruins. I'm so used to sandstorms, I don't even need goggles anymore. Am I might to be challenged? His eyes are just bloodshot red and like watering constantly. Ruin ma maniac, Dusty. Giovanni was daddy AF. The big uh, Yakuza member who was just absolutely fine with a wee Wayne cutting about his... Beat him in a pro... Oh fuck, I forgot Reginald this week. Mate, that isn't how it works. You're probably just blind by now. Like I said, just dry, these dry, crusty, like... Eyes that are just red and... Ugh. Right, fuck this ball toy. Uh, did you get Ice Fang for the bird gym? Yes, I did. But it's still it's still going to hurt. I'm still terrified of that. Uh, what's it called? I'm still terrified of that Alteria. Just make Aqua Dog really, really fast. I, I think I've got an item that helps speed. Oh shit. Fuck his Crush Claw. Oh. Right, I should probably be careful here. Aqua Dog's about halfway. Right, come on, Aqua Dog, use Aqua Tail, come on. We should be okay. So I started playing uh, Pokemon Sword again last night just because I was like, oh fuck it, I'll get, I'm gonna get Scarlet anyway. I might as well try and finish up. Because I've got the second DLC to finish in that. And I forget how fucking... How... Oh, I don't want to say like, how bit much better it is, but how many improvements I've made. Because I really like Sword. I really like Sword and Shield. But just with the thing, the differences like... Fast travel, no HMs... You know... Really sort of helps the... Enjoy Sword a lot, it's pretty charming to eye. I. I had a lot of fun with it. I know people were saying that it's like... I know people were giving it shit. I had a great time with it, you know? It's actually on the list for me to stream eventually. Because I want... I want to play maybe like a Pokemon game every now and then, you know? Because they do take up quite a lot of time. It's not up. It's not the one coming up next. There's another Pokemon game I plan to play before any of them, but I think actually I've already announced what one it is, it's the Heart Gold Randomizer. Which I'm really looking forward to that. Everything's uh, is just to take up your challenge to a permadeath run for each game. Oof. I mean, I'm... Like, I casually play Pokemon a lot, but the permadeath run has been really interesting. Or like as in you have... Uh, or in someone... Yeah, oh yeah, we could easily do the full... 
it's only because I want I generally wanted to play Omega Ruby again because I really like this version. So I was like, yeah, I can replay it and do a wee per interesting run on, you know. Oh, I'm heading down to Madal, aren't I? Where's Madal live again? I think it could be fun collectively to do them all that way. It could be fun. What one would you play, Crash? You've got you've got your choice to play any of them. Fucking Winstrits, pricks. I forgot there's another Winstrit in the f Victory Road, so hopefully he doesn't do me in as bad as his fucking granny did. Right, so I generally can't remember how to. Oh, fuck. What's attacking me? Is it the Geodude? Gold would be my go to, but I'd be open for Sun or Sword as well. Oh, Sun's interesting because I've never actually played Sun. Oh, it's levitating, isn't he? Wait, no, it still hits. Like, for some reason, like, I played this, but I missed out on uh, Sun and Ultra Sun. Or, you know, that, that gen. So, that'd be interesting to see. And I don't actually know much about them apart from some of the like, alternative forms of Pokemon. And I know it doesn't really use gyms, which is interesting, you know? No, oh, excuse me. Excuse me. A sort of gems, but every island has a main boss. You need to defeat. Ah, that makes that probably makes more sense. Oh shit, I got strength, didn't I? And it's a totem Pokemon or something. Oh, that sounds pretty cool. Strength. Who can learn strength? Uh, fuck it. We'll give it to Pika Blue. What will we get rid of for Pika Blue? Uh, Aqua Tail. We've already got an Aqua Tail, so. What, what Pokemon did I take out my team? Is that. Oh, shit. What's this? It's a coughing. Oh, I like coughing. I really like. Uh, was it in Sword and Shield they put in the new version of Weezing, which has the top hat? I like that. Right, something tells me we're no catching this one. Right, we'll use strength. Here we go. Big, beefy, Azumarill. Let's go. Oh, this takes forever. Where does this take me? I've actually completely forgotten where this... Shit. Got a feeling I may have blocked myself out here. I think I was maybe to put that somewhere else. Oh wait, no, I think we're good. And Numel. We're just gonna run. See where it's taking me. I think it's been that. It feels like it's been that long since I played it. That a Firestone. Oh, that could be interesting, but I don't actually know any. What was the one I was looking for? Was it a Waterstone I was wanting? No, it was a fucking Leaf Stone for my boy Shiftry, but uh, not Shiftry. Uh, Nuz Nuzleaf, big nut, but obviously not met a uh, you know unfortunate end. Listen here. TM Toxic. That could be interesting. And that, is that a base? All the way in here? Is there a way for you to evolve Reginald in this Barrow's copy? Yeah, it'll just stay a Graveler. Because this is just the, like, plain Pokemon uh, Omega Ruby. It's not like a hacked one that has any sort of way of... Actually, that's a lie. The the Barrow's uh, DS, DS I've got does use online uh it can use online play, 
I don't know how to set it up. I've just seen the option for it. I don't know how to do it. And it seems like a lot of work just to go on the message board and be like, here, can someone trade me my fucking graveler? Do I really have to cut through it so no Game Shark stuff? No, I don't. I don't know Game Shark stuff. I probably could if I really tr uh, tried. But it's alright, I can't I like Reginald, I think he'll grow on us. Right, we're just gonna run through this fight. Wait, why am I coming here? This is the I've went the wrong way. Ah Poor Reginald, a teenager forever. A four armed, weird looking teenager. I'm not going this way, I'm going to the what you got? I need to go back to Just cut through a desert. I spent the first, uh, we've got nearly half hour of the stream doing nothing. Right, so I go up, go up here and I use the zip line. What I'll do is I meant to actually go do some extra, but I can't remember what I was meant to do. We'll come back to the desert later on because I will actually, I will actually try and catch a few legendaries. Like, I don't know if it's a hot take, but I think the Reggies, like, Reggie, Ice, Reggie Steel or not, they're cool as fuck. I'm not about, I don't really quite like the new ones, because I've seen they add in, like, a, was it, a electric one, which I wasn't a big fan of that design, but I really like, like, when I first seen them, they, I thought, oh, they're cool as fuck, like, fucking giant monsters, whatever, like, Reggie Steel was cool as fuck. A dragon and an electric one, I wasn't big on their designs. I thought Reggie Gygus was cool as fuck, because he looked like a fucking... Colossi, but I don't think he's very. I don't think he's very good. Could I remember? I really hated Reggie Gigas' design. Ah, I can see it. I think the white sort of. I think if it was a different color, like maybe a grey, it'd look kind of cool. But and also, I I was thinking this because I was playing through uh, in Sword and Shield. Uh, because in the DLC areas, your Pokemon can follow you around. And my Groudon suddenly wasn't that big. Like, he's a big boy, but he's not as big as I imagined him to be. I imagine it would be similar with Reggie Gigas, if you know what I mean? Like, you'd expect him to be this fucking Kaiju, fucking tower and monster, you know? But he was kind of just, you know, there. When will we get a regional variant of Groudon, I wonder? Oh, like a poison Groudon? Oh, that'd be cool as fuck. Just Groudon's awesome. I like, I really like Groudon and Kyogre. Prefer Groudon though, but that they're both cool. Probably my second favourite. Right, we'll we'll move poor Kieran out there into the substitutes. So in the substitutes we have Caught in the Swablu. Dennis and Yumil, Chopper the Mashup, Gulp and Cum the Sway Lot, Velma the Zigzagoon, Buddy 2 the Electric, which I think we're going to take out. I think I really like Cotton, I can't want to get Cotton leveled up, but Cotton takes ages to level up. Will we bring out Cotton? Who will we get rid of? And who isn't pulling their weight? Your Rex is taking his time, but see once Rex eventually evolves, as we hatch Lily already, I have no clue what Lily is. What I'll do is I'll go... I think part of me kind of wants to, I don't want to say grind it off screen, but just get, you know, do this for hours, which I could do when I was young. I could do off screen and not really care about. But... It'll take a long time to hatch. Right, fuck it, let's go ahead to my dad. Let's go barter my dad. Hey, where's Brendan? Where is he? There he is. How about it? We'll go back to Petalburg together. Yes, because I can't remember where to go. Yeah? Then let's hit it. Yeah, so here we go. Back to Petalburg, because I couldn't be bored walking all the way. So we're here, Petalburg City. Mickey, do your best with the gym. I'm behind you all the way. See ya!
Well, we go straight into the gym. Right, so what have we got? Let's have a wee gander. Right, so we've got... I might actually put Lily back in. Right, I'm going to put Lily back in for now. Let's sub Aqua Dog out. What are you thinking? Is that in case Aqua Dog... Uh, in case we wipe? Oh, I could level, I could level Chopper up a bit more. I fear for, yeah, we'll, we'll take Aqua Dog out and we'll get Golfing coming. Because at least if we, at least if we wipe, at least if we wipe, Aqua Dog's still there to carry the team. Right, what type is my dice? Normal type, isn't it? Yo, how's it going, champ, to be Mikey? Doors in this room open when you beat awaiting trainers. Whoops, the doors in this room are already open, so attack me. Aquadog's death is pure reset moment. Cheers a petal bug gym. Use all kinds of items. Door to the left leads to the speed room, the accuracy room. Uh once you've chosen the door, hey, go for it. Let's go. What's what one's this? Speed room. Yes. I like this gimmick that it's like that trainers do use items. That's a Interesting and maybe a wee bit different from other gyms, you know, so it's not... Hey, fuck it, Reggie, let's go! Being able to attack before an opponent, that confers a great advantage in battle, wouldn't you agree? Big ace trainer Randall sends it Delicati. Oh, that would have been what, uh... Mac... I, can't, I forget what the cat's... What was the cat's name? What's the cat's name? We Punchy. Oh, we mean what Punchy turned into. Oh, what a shame. Poor Punchy. Rest in peace, Punchy. Uh, anyways, let's bulldoze this. Oh, I thought I was going to one shot kill it there. Uh, fuck it, Rock Blast. No use using up PP for other attacks. No! Reginald! Put it back in your pants, Reginald. Reginald! No! Would have been so good to have Chopper ready for this. It would have. It's one of... Fuck! Reginald, no! Chopper was probably the, the right idea, but I, f I forgot to level him up. Uh, do I have Edna to wake him up? Like a swift kick in the balls? Uh, full heal, that'll do. Just spray it in his eyes. Let's go. Reginald woke up. Well, I don't, I don't think we need to worry about the damage here. Something tells me we'll be absolutely fine. Right, Reginald, I know you're deeply in love and you've just woke up, but fucking blast that wee cat with a rock. Oh, Jesus. Right, here we go. The wee cat's just trying to annoy me to death. Reg Reginald! For fuck's sake, Reginald! Right, finally! Just get that meme of like Wesley Snipes crying holding up a gun with Reggie's uh, thing over it. This person only has one low level cat and it's taking so long to beat. It's because Reginald's been uh, put to sleep and in madly in love with him. So we had to take them out. Now move on to the next room where you'll find a new challenge awaiting you. Left is the zero reduction room. Right leads to the defense room. Zero reduction or defense? What do we think? Fuck knows what I can't remember what zero reduction is. It sounds scary. Fuck it, let's go. Because I have no clue what it is. Zero reduction. Do you want to enter? Because I'm not when he, I'm not. Like, I play Pokemon games very casually. Don't even waste time trying to lower my Pokemon stats. It's okay, most of my moves are fucking boost moves. L L Lin. Oh! That would have been fucking Cooper. You know what? Magnitude. Magnitude 6, let's go! Is that the same animation as uh, 
Bulldoze. Critical hit. Oh, nice. Rock Blast. No need to waste it on. Yes, man. Playing in mud. Electricity's power is weakened. Yes, man. Zero reduction. My arse. The only thing it was reduced was his health points. Yes, man. Let's fucking go. Reginald's level 39. Chopper grew to level 70. Why did I bring Chopper? I think I've got Chopper just as a sort of... Oh, everyone's leveling up. I think I've just got Chopper as like a shield. If I need someone to take a hit, Chopper can do it. Oh! Rex is evolving! Finally! Let's go Rex! Come on! There we go! Yes, man! He's turned into a... Larion. My team's gonna be nothing but just awkward mid-stages of Pokémon. Next room is a strength room. Can you withstand its brute force? Let's go! Right, uh, since it's normal, will I trade out for... I'll, I'll switch uh, Revenge in. Revenge might, might be able to take us. Our gym leader told us to put all the stops to beat you. If you to happen to be the leader's own daughter. Here we go, Ace Trainer Jody. What's Jody got? A Zangus. Oh, that Pokemon I thought was cool as fuck when I was an edgy teenager. Uh, Magical Leaf. Oh fuck, X Attack, this could be bad. Come on, Magical Leaf, take it out, come on. Right, come on, one more Magical Leaf. Thank God Revenge is faster. Yes, man, Revenge doing God's work. Oh, Chopper's level 18 now. But oh, I went all out. Yes, man, can he beat Revenge? The way handy your Pokemon reminds me of your father's style. Go on, go on through. The gym leader, no, your father is waiting. Uh, do we need to heal up? No, that's, that's my badges we're looking at. No, we don't need to see that. Bag. Let's have a look. Uh, you know, we'll, we'll sit and do uh, TMs afterwards. I'm looking for... Nope. There we go. Don't take a coward's path. I'm just checking for, like... Give Reggie a wee heal. Go fight all the our trainers. See... Fuck it, you're right. Oh. Door's locked. Can I take... Defense room. Let's take on the defense boys. The higher Pokemon my defense, the more reckless I can be with my attacks. Right, what's the lore we got? Oh, so they'll all have like the same Pokemon that wait, not wave, but you know what I mean, that sort of that set. Right. Magical Magical Leaf, let's go. And then Giga Drain, that should be it. No! Oh shit. I thought I was about to fall in love with it again, but it's okay. Revenigate's all healed up. Revenge is sweet. Let's go. Yes, man. I think you've taught me a valuable lesson here. Go on. The left door leads to the strength room. We've already done that. Oh, God. The one-hit KO room. Oh, boys. The one-hit KO room. Oh, no. <laughs> Oh, this one's gonna be scary. I'm not gonna take it easy just because you're a leader's kid. I'll show you how horrible it is for a Pokemon to take a critical hit. Oh, please don't, pal. Big Berk. Right, sends out a Zangus. Right, let's go. Uh, 
no point using... Fuck, right, here we go. Zangus getting pumped. Right, you know what, fucking magical leaf, let's go. Yes, man! The fear that was in my body there when that th if that thing hit me with a one-shot kill. Even though I'm 10 levels higher than it. Still the fear. Chopper grew to level 19. Yes, man. Chopper wants to learn revenge. Oh! Learn for the best. Uh, what have we got? Karate Chop, Foresight, Seismic Toss. What's Low Sweep, Karate Chop. Get rid of Karate Chop. Revenge is the one that, like, it does damage it if you hit second. I think. Your power. You're the real deal. Yes, man. You're looking at the meal deal now. Let's go. Right, I know. Right. I can't bother. I'll fight my dad now. Gym leader's room. See for yourself what Pokemon await you. Do you want to enter? Yes. Oh, wait. I was going to heal up first. Shit. I'm locked in animation. Looking at my dad. So he did get four gym badges. Then as I promised, we'll have a Pokemon battle. Right, here we go. Where's Bag? Soda Pop. Just get Gluggin' Revenge. Get Gluggin' that Pepsi. Let's go. I know what we'll send in... We'll send in Goblin Come first. Mikey. It makes me happier than I can really describe. Being able to have a real battle with my own daughter like this. But a battle is a battle. I will do everything in my power as a gym leader to win. You better give it your best shot too, Mikey. Oh, here we go. My dad's going to bar me. Versus Big Norman. Storming Norman. Let's go. Oh, fuck. Oh, I forget he's got two slaking, doesn't he? Oh, this Pokemon's cool as fuck, though it sleeps in between turns, doesn't it? Oh man, Slaking's just really cool. Right, uh, Stockpile. I should have done Toxic first, shouldn't I? Don't put my big boy to sleep, don't you dare. Are you like, he fucking loves playing Brian Adams. My dad's not even a Brian Adams, Adams fan. My dad loves Selic, the Talking Heads, and Pink Floyd, but doesn't he like Brian Adams? So the memes... The memes deed. Spit up. Don't fall asleep. Don't fall asleep. Okay, that was a lot of build up for an attack that wasn't really worth it. And he fell asleep. My god, you're gonna wake up and you're gonna do toxic. Oh Jesus. Right, come on, Goblin, come, come on. So okay, I knew we had to... Right, yes, man. And then I will just do a wee... Soda pop. Get gogging that Pepsi. On you go, pal. Oh, wait. On... Oh, shit. That means I can... Wait, can I only use uh, items then? Is that the gimmick? Uh, go stockpile. Can I only use toxic? I don't know how useful that is considering these are depoisoned. Ah, well. This is going to be a slow fight. Norman, you prick. Most of the poison's already pretty bad, so... Then we stockpile. Ah! The most interesting fight in the game. Ah, he's put us to sleep again. God damn it. Hopefully Encore wears off soon. There we go. Encore ended. Stockpile. Hopefully I should do this before I fall asleep. <laughs> Incredible battle. I know. Everyone's like... Edge of your seats. One cunt sleeping and our cunt can only just you know keep spitting at people and do chip damage. 
Now both the boys are sleeping. What a time. What a battle, boys. Don't fucking encore. That means I can only use stockpile. God damn it. Right, Goblin comes in and trade out after this. Unless I can get a, a sl one slaking down. Right, there we go. Easy peasy. Oh, Chopper's level 20 now. Yes, man. Vigor Vigoroth, what's that? Sounds like a fucking Lord of the Rings like bad guy you've never heard of. Is that not his middle form? Yeah, because it's got like a cool sort of sloth first form, and it's got, which we've not actually ran into one of them yet. I want you to stop here, god damn it. Also, I like animation, that's really cool. Very sort of. Maybe like Samurai movie, isn't it? Just make Goblin come a big fucking tank of a boy. Yeah, Cherry Blossoms, that's ve yeah. Very Kurosawa. It's just like Persona. Persona invented the Samurai movies, don't you know? Right, stockpile. D don't! No! I fucking hate Encore! Uh, I guess we got to use Toxic again, fuck. No, man, come on. Come on, Goblin, come, you can do this. I don't want to trade it because then our Pokemon's got to get a shot. Come on. Come on, we can do this. As soon as it Encore wears off. Swallow. No, don't use Encore. Fuck. Oh, he's going to run out of PP. I wonder what's going to happen if he can't. He's ran out of PP now, but it's okay. Because Vigoroth has fainted. There we go. Right, I'll try Revenge go to level 37. Revenge wants to learn Petal Blizzard. The fuck is Petal Blizzard? Let's have a look. Advanced Petal Blizzard attacks everyone around it. 90 with an accuracy of 100. Yeah, I'll get rid, I'll get rid of the Sweet Scent Fact. That sounds really cool. Ward's a cool name. I bet it's pretty useless. Slay King. Uh, and then what we'll do is we'll have Goblin come heal. I want to see how much he can heal off Stockpile, just out of curiosity. Swallow. No, man! How is that? Oh, fuck. Goblin comes deed. We've lost one. We'll never... we got one boy down. Uh, does Slay... Oh, God. Slay King might have fighting moves, so I don't want to send Reginald out. Fuck it. Revenge is going out. Right, Revenge, let's try this new move. Petal Blizzard. Okay, I thought that would be much a much cooler... I think it would do more damage than what it did, but I think this thing's maybe just got a crazy amount of health. And chipping away, away with Toxic was probably the best way to do it. Wait. Oh my god, right, uh... Hopefully this will take it out. Come on, I'm playing Risky here. Oh, thank God. Oh, that was a risky play, but paid off. Oh. So, okay, we only lost the Gulp and Come. Which I'm not broken up about. We're okay. Duracell wants to learn agility. It lost your anxiety and nearly lost your revenge. Revenge, I could not lose. Revenge is carrying me through this. Uh, what's Discharge? Uh, make us process. What's Volt Switch? Yeah, we'll get my Volt Switch. And Chopper go to level 21. Yes, man. Chopper wants to learn knockoff. Give up a learn knockoff. Yep. We've beat Norman. Yes, I'm battered, my da. Impossible. Mikey received all that money. Yes, man. Geese pocket money, old prick. Yes, man. I can't believe it. I lost to Mikey. You've come this far. 
That's how it is then. I will give you this. Yes, man. Mikey received the balance badge from her dad. I can't believe it. I've lost to Mikey. A normal reaction. Yes, man. That's what Chronicle said when I bartered him at uh, Street Fighter Third Strike. Yes, man. Having that badge will ensure Pokemon uh, up to level 60 will be you, even if you receive them in trades. Pokemon and uh, no, the HM move Surf will be able to travel over water now. Yes, man. Wait, where, where'd I get Surf? Wait, have I not got Surf yet? Shit. And I got Retaliate. That's that cool one. Retaliate will like, allow you to take revenge for a fallen team member. It's probably doubled if you have a Pokemon use it in the very much next move right after an ally faints. Hope you and your Pokemon will be diligent uh, enough to use it wisely. You get Surf later, it's fine. That's okay. I got scared there. Sigh. As a gym leader, I can't express how frustrated I am. But as a father, it makes me both happy and a little sad. It's odd. Come on, Mikey. I'll see you on your way. Let's get out of here. Oh, do we, I think we get surf a bit here, yeah. Oh, fuck off, Wally. Ah, Mikey, Mr. Norman. I haven't seen you two in some time. What a coincidence. I just came back to my parents' house to grab something I'd forgotten. Which means working hard, Wally. It's clear even without a battle. You were supposed to go next door to get Surf originally. Really? You think so? Hee <laughs> hee, thank you. It's so nice of you to say. Ah, Mikey, isn't it? I'm glad to see you here. I'm Wally's father, of course. As you can see, Wally's health is thoroughly improved. All thanks to you and your father. You two helped Wally catch the first Pokemon that day. It's because of you he has a partner of his own now. That partner is why he's grown so strong. That's my firm belief, so I thank you. Yep, that's it. Sometimes words aren't enough. It would delight me if you'd take this. I bet Wally felt great passing through the ash area, I just... And then the desert as well without any goggles. Yes, I've got Surf. You're clear to your Surf outside battle. You'll be able to cross seas with your Pokemon. Mikey, considering how much you and Wally have grown, you should be able to handle what lies beyond the sea in Route 80, uh, 118 now. There are far stronger Pokemon trainers waiting for you on Hoenn's east coast. Continue your journey and adventures there. I know you'll do your best. He doesn't need the goggles for the desert though. You just need to get used to it. Yes, sir. I'll do my best to become as strong as Mikey, sir. Guess I better head out then. I'm off now, Dad. See you next time. Um, Come on, Mikey. Let's go together. Wally, I look forward to seeing you and your Pokemon stro grow stronger together. Mikey, well, take care of yourself out there. Don't forget to drop by a little route to visit your mother from time to time. Nah, you're alright. Okay, we're off. Be safe out there. Learn a lot. Yes, and just two dads chilling. Does your dad ever stop by a little route? Yeah, my dad literally lives like a 10 minute walk away and never comes to see my ma. What the fuck? I don't know what it is, but... Hmm? See my little boy all grown up and going off on his own. As a far, makes me happy and a little sad. Ha, huh, what a coincidence. Caught myself thinking the same thing. Ho oh, ho, is that so? But if only... If only my boy keeps growing strong and healthy like that, I wouldn't ask for anything else. I know exactly what you mean. Wait, where are, where are we going? Mr Norman told us to keep going beyond Route 118, didn't he? Let me check my area nav. It's east of Marvel City. Making sure, uh, let's go to Marvel together. I'm definitely planning to go check out Route uh, 118, like your dad said. Fuck off, Wally. Phew. It's actually pretty far, isn't it? All the way here to Marvel. That must be Route 118 ahead. I wonder what kind of Pokemon I'll meet there. Can't wait to find out. See you later, Mikey. I'll be going straight to Route 118. Let's definitely have a battle next time we meet. It's a promise, okay? And you can't break a promise. Fuck off, Wally. Be prick. Right, we've just got to pop in here and we're going to drop off our fallen party member and then get ourselves geared up for the Route 118. As if they've not said it enough this turn. Uh. You know what? We'll keep Chopper in here. I, I keep meaning to bring Cotton with us, but 
Actually, no. Gob sorry, Goblin Cum. You're not in the substitutes. And rest in peace. Hatched Lily. Right, fine. We'll, uh, uh, who will I trade out for? No one I really want to trade out. Right, we'll, I'll come back to it. I don't want to trade Duracell out. Duracell's my boy. Duracell's the reason we're still here. Oh, I would have wiped with no... Right, fine, well... Actually, who doesn't need a level? Actually, Duracell's... Is Duracell our strongest Pokemon? No, Reginald's our strongest. Right, fuck it, we'll trade... Yeah, we'll, we'll come back for Red, uh, Duracell. Because Duracell will be really useful next gym. I can't believe one of my main Pokemon this is a fucking Minon. Or Minon. Yeah, teach someone Surf. Who's gonna learn Surf? I wonder who's gonna learn Surf. Uh, surf, Surf, Surf. Can the Egg learn Surf? I'll just get rid of... I'll get rid of Twister. Twi Twister's not a super good move. Oh, I'll get rid of Aqua Tail. I'll get rid of twi Twister. Twister's pretty useful. Yeah, useless actually. Just the amount of damage it does. Right, here we go. Route 118, let's go! Out my way, boysies. Water is a deep, deep blue. Would you like to surf? Yes. Right, can we sneak up on this? Ah, yeah, bastard, you. It's really difficult to do sneaking on this uh, analog stick. Oh, you're back. Oh, Mikey. Hi, do you remember us from last time? Can you show us how much stronger you've become? Okay, Q interview. We're challenged by Gabby and Ty. Magneton and Loudred. Oh, fuck, what can I... Wait, what can I do to... Oh, fuck, get Chopper out there. Chopper, run. Aqua Dog will do surf hits. Everyone can't can't be doing that. And oh fuck, Aqua Dog! I just clicked. Wait, get Reginald in there. I've clicked. He's a lucky type. I probably should have went for the lucky type first. Right, come on, Reginald, come on. It's okay. It's for some reason decided to use mirror attacks on. Oh! Oh fuck, Reginald. Wait, that's it. Fuck. Uh. Right, we're taking it to Magneton first because that thing is dangerous. Right. Uh. Bulldoze hits everyone. Wait, it doesn't because my uh, magnitude hits. Aquadog's floating, so is... Hmm... Let's keep, uh, we just got my boy up. Nice and high, or nice and strong. Why did I use Aquatail? I should use the Ice Fang, Aquatail's not gonna do it. Oh, that's okay, one shot at it. Oh, that's okay. Oh, the fear that, that hit me there. Yes, man, Reginald's good to level 40. What a big boy. They want some earthquake. Yeah, we'll get. Earthquake's ground, isn't it? Uh. Yeah, fuck it. We'll get rid of the bulldoze and we'll get earthquake instead. Chopper's level 22. Oh, my boy. Oh, and Rex is level 33. That gets more powerful every turn, doesn't it? Ah, you know what? Fuck it. Rocks on, let's punch it with my feet. Let's go. Uh, magnitude. You really should have like, a set, a definitive like tag team for my Pokemon. Because these two do not work well together at all. 
What an awesome battle. Hey, did you get all that? Every last bit of that battle we had is just is just is on tape. I couldn't talk there. Fucking hell. Rip, buddy. Do you remember? That's the quote you gave us last time. Uh, uh, the quote you gave us at the battle clincher last time. I never ever forget stuff like that. Anyway, what do you think? Do you want to be interviewed again? No. Oh, okay, but don't give up. We'll be keeping an eye out for you. Are you fucking better? With Pokemon champion in no time. Fucking nearly killed my Pokemon. You know, we didn't spend long in the water. They made it sound like it was going to be a big trek that we're taking. Instead, it's... Is there anything here? No. Oh, fuck, it's Big, big Sven. Why, hello? Met in Granite Cave, didn't we? No, I remember. It's Mikey. Right? It's good to see your journey's going well. Okay. In this vast world, there are many kinds of Pokemon. They come in many types. Should you raise different types? Or would you only raise Pokemon of a certain type you like? I wonder what you think as a Pokemon trainer. Not as anything that should be concerned myself with. But somehow I find myself wanting to know what you think. I suppose I should be going. Hope to see uh, see you again though. Oh, what's this? Hmm? Oh, is this when you get a free legendary? I think it is. Oh, the red one's much cooler than the blue one. I can't, I can't remember the difference. Like what one's Latios and what one's Lati Latias? There we go, Latios is the blue one. Do you want us to soar somewhere with you? Mikey, come with me. Latias, I believe it, uh, I believe it sought us out for help. If that's the case, then let's go. Yes, man, here we go. We're getting taken to a strange island, which in the post game is how you get legendaries. Through these strange little islands, we've arrived. Or the legendaries that are from other games, you know. Thank you, Latias. I don't know what it is. It's not quite unease, but not quite fear. But it's something unsettling. It's an odd feeling. As though I'm waking in a dream or an illusion. Once I heard an odd fable. It was that two Pokemon living this island guard some sort of secret about a great form of ev of evolution. Mega evolution? Could it be that some dangerous element he is here because of that? Come, we should be going. What does he want to do? Would you like to return? Uh, no. Let's see what's on the island. That wet mem de suit to carp that Roots. Those whose memories fade seek to carve them in their hearts. Yes, yeah, so let's go. I can't remember what. If I'm walking right into a boss fight. Wait, you have Latios already? You can fly already? I forgot. It's Latios, it's beautiful. I don't think you get fly just yet. Or even there. So. I think you get it, and then you get Mega Evolution later on, which gives you like, this mad free flying mode. If I was to describe such beauty in terms of a stone, it'd be a water stone. No, it goes beyond that. So, isn't it? It's brown, it's like a dawn stone. It's a fantastic as a steel type Pokemon. Oh fuck, Magma boys. Hmm? Team Magma, is it? So Latios noticed uh, they're coming, and it's why it's called on us. Who are you? Ha! Mistress Courtney, that pipsqueak over there is the kid that I heard keeps getting in our way. But that, uh, evidently unruffled looking fellow there with him, I feel like I ought to know him from somewhere. Maybe he's a contest star? Yes, for the time being. Get away from me. That Pokemon behind you, it's Megastone. No more, no less. Is that's what? That's what Team Magma seek. How about it? Will you get away from me? Or not? Sure, why not? Nah, I won't. That's right, full points for the correct answer. I'll take part in this battle as well. Let's put Latios from these beasts together. We can't allow Latios or even a Megastone to fall in the hands of such villains. Well then. Deleting. Is she a robot? I kinda like Courtney. 
Team Magma Admin Courtney and Team Magma Grunt. Let's go. Cam rupt and coughing. Oh shit. Right, what level are we talking here? Ah, so gets a Aqua Dog will take care of them. And what we just do is surf. Sorry, my time. Not my problem. Aqua Dog just one shot at the pair of them. Yes, man. Aqua Dog is roidy as fuck. Chopper grew to level 23. What does Chopper evolve? Slurp. That's just a strong, right? Yeah. As anticipated. Unanticipated. You. Target lock. Completed. Commencing. Experiment. You forever. Aha. Returning home. But wait for me. Courtney. I like his wee walk he does. Ha. Good work, Mikey. Ah, that's right. We should first heal up the Pokemon that fought on our behalf, shouldn't we? Yeah, because I've done quite a fucking quite a lot of damage to your Metang. You performed spectacularly. Pardon me. We were able to protect both this wondrous Pokemon and its Megastone, thanks to you. And it looks like though Latios may have recognised you as a trainer worthy of its trust. Look, it's trying to offer you its allegiance. I believe it's trying to show that it wants to go with you on your journey. Go on, hold out your hand to it. Yes, man, we got a free legendary. Your party is full. Please for the Pokemon to send back to the PC. Uh, revenge, go take a wee rest. Would you like to give a nickname to Latios? What are we calling Latios? This legendary dragon engine type, I don't know what it's meant to be exactly. Uh, call it Jet after my favourite member of the the gladiators. I'd like to nickname it Jet with two T's, yes. I should have called it Jet as in like Final Fantasy X Jet. God damn it. It's carrying a Latio site. You should take this from me. Oh, now we can do Mega Evolutions, can't we? When my, when my mad Power Rangers bracelet thing. What was the Power Rangers when they had the... All of them have the wee bracelet with the thing on them? I was remember in space had a really cool sort of one there. They'd type in a code and numbers would flash up on the screen. Oh, it was cool. Power Rangers in space was banging. That was the last one I watched, but... Don't know why I've ended up in that. The bracelet, I guess. With the Mega Bracelet I gave you and the Mega Stones that a Pokemon may hold, your Pokemon will be able to achieve powerful boost, quite unlike any form of evolution. But only, are, uh, only if you are bound by great affection, you'll be able to achieve Mega Evolution. I would suggest you try that with Latios next time that you happen to have a chance in battle. Mega Evolution is a phenomenon that has been a long shrouded mystery. What is a Megastone? What is a Keystone? The process which bonds between Pokemon and people manifests in tangible power. How do we explain that? I hope that the Mega Bracelet I just gave you might bring us one step closer in finding the answer to these questions. That settles that. Should we be heading back? Get with Latias waiting so patiently for us there. So... Yeah, we've now got Mega Evolution and we can now Mega Evolve uh, Latias. I remember Gyarados can Mega Evolve. I can't remember where you get the... Because some of them only appear in like... Some appear in X and Y, some of them appear in Alpha Sapphire. So it's not as simple as just, you know, picking up... Uh, I'm just going to look up Gyarados... Type. Omega Ruby. Uh, where can I find it? So I've got the, I've got them on Serbi.net. But I know what it is. Uh, route one, two, three. We'll get that, and then we can get big, mega Aqua Dog. Perhaps I tell you to take good care of Latios. 
I'll take great care of him. Hopefully I won't end up dead in a PC somewhere. In the end, you are far great help than I expected you might be. I expect that you and your team will be able to best both of Route 119 and even the 4-tree gym beyond that. I'm curious to see how much stronger you might grow by the next time we meet. Until then, Mikey. Oh. What have we got? What kind of Pokemon are here? Oh, an electric. Actually, it's level 22, so... Fuck it, Ice Fang, let's go! I wonder what level, uh, would you call it as? Latios. Give a wee gander at that, let's have a wee... Pokemon... Latios is level 30. Heal Pulse, Dragon Breath, Luster Purge... What the fuck is Luster Purge and Cycle Shift? Right. How's the egg doing? It'll take a long time to hatch. Right, so I can't really remember. Am I going up the way or am I going... I'm going... Oh shit, trainer. Jump scared me there. Take flight, my bird Pokemon. Oh, the one time I don't have my wee lecky boys. You're trying by bird keeper Chester. Oh fuck. It's Chester. We've got a wee Swablu. Right, come on, Jet, let's see what you can do. Imagine if Latios died and you got locked out of that later content. Luckily, you don't get locked out because I have actually have died before uh, with my Latios and... Right, let's see a Mega Evolution. Just for... Oh, it's kind of... kind of dumb. Oh! Whatever cycle shift was, it failed. I like the theory of, uh... Like, obviously if Latios dies, you can't fly around on it and go to around it anymore. Oh, it's, uh... The weird thing is, even if it's in your PC, because I don't... I never used, uh... Latios, because I'm not... I don't actually like its design that much. Uh, you can still use it to fly around, but even if it's in your PC... Oh, I see what you mean, yeah. The logic of it. We'll have to bend the rules a little bit. Swallow, is that just the... Right, uh... Fuck the Luster Purge. No rule bending, if it dies, it dies. Right, here we go. So it's it's just not a high enough level for to, for me to justify carrying it about. Because that was at Mega Evolved, and it was it's not as if it can die. Kind of carries you for the rest of the game. Yeah, especially for the post-game content, like, it's always there in the background. Bird Pokemon that fly elegantly in the sky, they're the best. Oh, why did I have to get rid of Duracell? Duracell would make... Oh, fuck, I forgot to trade out. The thing is, why wouldn't I just Mega Evolve every chance I get? That's why I'm looking forward to getting a uh, big Gyarados site, so I can get... Big Mega Gyarados. Mega Aqua Boy. At least in... Uh, I thought it was Payback. At least in uh, Sword and Shield, like, Dynamax is saved for, like, sta like, in context, like, stadium shows, you know? I think there's a... I can't remember if there's a story... There is a story explanation to that. But... I like the context, and it's not just like in a wee field and fucking, you know, in route fucking 118. What Pokemon have we got here? Is this, can I catch a Duskull here? Because I fucking love Duskull. I think Duskull's cool as fuck. Not a big fan of Duskull. Actually, I like Dusclops. Dusclops, I don't like Dusk Noir. 
Don't think Dustin Horrors is cool. Dusclops is alright, but Dust Skull is pretty cool. It's keeping the thing of Ghost Pokemon and the middle evolution being cooler. Because it's the same with Haunter. Haunter's cool as fuck. Like, in Sword, I've actually got a shiny Haunter that I refuse to evolve. Because I just think shiny Haunter's cooler. Go away, Electric. Dragon Breath. There we go. Yes, man. I'm going to trade Jet out. I'm going to put... Uh, switch Jet with Reginald. There we go. Thanks to that, I rounded. I've been awakened to the adventure that is building a secret base. He said he'd be waiting for me with the secret base guild, but Fortree's far away. Yeah, we're not going to talk to the... Oh, God, here we go. I remember this section. It's no good. When I read a bike in tall grass, nobody can see my coolness. Can I read a bike in tall grass? I'm not... I generally wasn't trying to avoid anyone there. It's just how it went. What's in here? A lot of pelopers. I heard somewhere there was a cave, somewhere called Cave of Origin. It says that the spirits of Pokemon are revived there. Could something like that really happen? Oh, we can get Buddy back then. Look at you, you must be tired. Why don't you and your Pokemon take a rest here? Yes, man. Oh, wait, I've just noticed something. Uh, Game... Pokemon... Omega Ruby. Whereas I had it set to just normal uh, Ruby and Sapphire. Whoops. Right, so this is a point I can maybe... I thought uh, how you fly is by catching a whole flock of bird Pokemon and then hang on to them somehow. But it turns out like a HM move called Fly. I don't know. And the way my dream came true. I also feel like I've lost my dream. Feels really strange. Oh, look at you. For someone on an adventure, you're travelling awfully light. Right, Pokemon Ranger Casting. Wasn't there a game called Pokemon Ranger? Never played it. Maybe it was on DS, I think. Oh, I like Brelum. Brelum's cool. This is not a good mix, is it? I don't even have a fire type, though. No. Fuck it, Aquadog. Um, and surf. Let's go. Oh, not very effective. Got confused with the type things again. He's fine, hopefully that'll do something. For some reason it's just using punches and stuff on me, it's not using any grass moves, which would be more effective. Shit! Aquadog's paralyzed. It's okay, we'll get the full spirit afterwards. Oh shit. Right, uh Where's full heal? Full heal. Wait, do I have anything that's just for berries? Let's have a look. Poison paralysis, there we go. Not not Reginald. Aquadug, there we go. Good old Aquadug. I can't be able to skip through all those trainers. What's up here? Because I'm kind of worried where we're going to be level-wise for the next, uh... Fuck it, Earthquake, let's go! I'm kind of worried where we're going to be level-wise for the next, uh, gym. I don't want to be too low.
If I can get everyone to like mid thirties, we should be okay. Right, Jet's getting put in the bin. Not in the bin, but in the PC. Can I get across there? I need the bike, daughter. Yeah. Well, there goes a the shortcut. Can your Pokemon use the move Secret Bird to make a secret base out of a big pile of grass? I mean, they could if they wanted, but... Oh, here we go. All right, you're the first trainer we've met since we formed our team. We're Brains and Brawn. Get ready, because here we come. Oh, yeah, first trainer we've met since we teamed up. We're what you call Brains and Brawn. We'll do our utmost. You're trained by Brains and Brawn, Jail and Kale. Kadabra and Machoke. Oh, it's a cool... I can't like this gimmick of having, like... Reginald and Chopper. Shit, Chopper, get back in the... Oh, no, he's also a fighting type. Right, uh... Right, you hit Earthquake. And Chopper. You just trade it for Aquadug. And Aquadug, whatever you do, don't hit Surf. You will one-shot kill Reginald, and I really don't want that. Abra, you Reflect. Yes, man, Aquadog. Doesn't get affected. Kadabra's down, and then Aquadog can just one shot Machoke. Yes, man, Chopper's level 25. Chopper wants to learn Vital Throw. What the fuck is Vital Throw? Let's have a look. User attacks last in return, the throw never misses. Eh. Uh, Vex go to level 34. No, Reginald. Reginald survived. And then she is Rock Blast on Machoke. And Aqua Tail on Machoke. Oh, he avoided the fucking shit. I should have just hit Earthquake again. It's okay, come on, one more. Ah, five times, I will. Stop slapping Reginald. Right, and then we'll just do Rock Blast again, and Ice Fang, there we go. Right, that's my choke down. Well, I'll go back and heal. Oh, Aquadog's level 38, Aquadog wants to learn Rain Dance. I don't think Rain Dance is super, it probably is useful. Well, that's where you get a cast form, isn't it? And the... Uh, use detector mode in the dex nav. Apparently, the more you encounter the same Pokemon, the better search function will be. It's accurate search capability allows you to find rare Pokemon. To see if you can find Pokemon with strange moves or rare abilities. You probably can, pal. I'm just, I've not used it at all. Oh, fuck. a group horde of Oddish. Uh... Oh my god, there's so many Oddish. Uh, earthquake, just hit all of them with Earthquake. Oh my god, that sound. Just all the Oddish dying. I like the gimmick of a horde or something, that's pretty cool. Right, what we'll do is I'll heal up and then we'll fight a Pokemon Ranger. Uh, Hyper Potion, there we go. On you go, Vision, we'll get Glogan. I want whatever that item is. Who has the knowledge and the technique for survival? Pokemon Rangers, that's who. Big Ranger Jackson. Well, he'll have Surviper, and I think he might also have the... Oh, I forget what it's called. The one you get in Ruby that's a covenant of that. Um, Magnitude, fuck it. There we go. No, I got a Vigoroth and said, didn't expect that. That's my dad's Pokemon. Uh, Magnitude. Oh shit, wait, that's Fighting type. 
Oh, it's again not very effective. And then we'll take Earthquake. She just endure. Oh, so it's going to survive this turn. It endured the hit. Yeah, earthquake again. Let's go. Yes, yeah, so my Fury Swipe's got to do fuck all against me. Yes, yeah, so I'm Reginald. I didn't have enough Pokemon uh, know how. What's this? A PP Max. Yes, man, make my PP Max. Let's go. Uh, what are you? The vast guy holds untold promise. Nothing can compare to the sheer exhilaration of flight. I wonder if this, this is just giving you a sort of ideas going here. Maybe you should have some lucky boys in your team or some, you know, just to. Because there sure is a lot of flying uh, trainers here. Shit. None of these will affect uh, Swallow. Feed it to Aquadug. And I'll get guys like Revenge and stuff back in the party. Trade Jet and Lily out. Shit, the more double teams you use, the less I've got chance to hit Ice Fang. Let's just go. Yes, man, there we are. Should one shot kill him. Should. Reginald goes to level 40. Reginald levels up really quickly in comparison to other Pokemon. wonder if that's why we get so many electric sort of spawn in here. If it is going like hinting going here, maybe you should really catch one of these. Try and keep up with the leveling. We should be okay. There we go. Chopper's level 27. Chopper wants to learn wake up slap. Wait, what's wake up slap? Nope. What's the gimmick? Eh. eh. It does big damage onto a sleeping opponent, but I don't really have any Pokemon that do sleep. Look at duty is surprisingly boring. Hey, don't go near the Weather Institute. What, this Weather Institute? Please, uh, welcome to the Weather Institute. There seems to be some kind of disturbance on the second floor, but I'm professional. I'm not easily rattled. What's the health looking at? Health's fine. What's Lily like? What's Lily saying? It'll take a long time to hatch. Right, the second floor we're going to. Boss got interested in the research I've going on, so he sent us out. Quit your meddling. Big mate, Anna. Easy peasy. Just spam, uh, what you got? Spam magnitude. Magnitude 4? Come on, you can do better than that. Kirko hit. She's the assurance. What's this? Oh no. Okay, earthquake. Big guns. That's the mighty Anna down as it is a levitating type. Golbat. Yep, trade out to Aquadog and then Aquadog can use Ice on the poison, which I think Ice and po I think Ice is strong against poison, I think. Crown Gravel, you can devastate the landscape more than that. He should big Reginald, sure can. Reginald has been carrying us for quite a bit. How are you doing, Cronkle? How's your day going? Super effective. Yes, man. Big Aqueduct got the boys going. Let's go.
Jet's level 32. Ah, uh, don't. I don't care, Jet. Use it whatever you want. Blast it. Bla be best of bad, kid. I'm fine. Not much happening. That's sometimes the best, you know? Like, it's my first Saturday off in God knows how long, and it's it's been peaceful. And, oh, I'm loving it. It's great. I came here because I heard that the Institute is investigating the relationship between super ancient Pokemon and the weather. Oh. What games have you been playing recently? Team Magma Grunt, let's go. Big coughing. Right, but Reginald can't hit the coffin because the coffin's levitating. So, we're going to... We'll get Aquadog back out. This is probably how most of the fights with Team Aquas go. The fuck is Gyro Ball? Ah! Here we go, Ice Fang. Let's go. I'm only here because I thought this was time team. Ah, yes. Uh, Tony, we Tony Robinson and uh, Gary Dose have quite a lot in common. They look very similar. Uh, some guns from Magma have strange priorities. Oh, they're mental. Like, they're from based an apocalyptic cult that want to awaken this fucking Godzilla creature that will burn the earth. So, because other teams I can kind of understand, you know, like Team Rocket are out there just to, you know, breed Pokemon and get money, basically. And... What are the what other teams these are they're doing team this team Galact well no, team Galactic are even worse because they literally just want to end the world. They wanna wake up this big Freddy Krueger Pokemon that controls dreams or whatever. Been a long time since I played Platinum, so there might be more to it than that. Just what is this? Did, did leader Maxi know that this would happen like this? Curse you! The press results of my research. Give them back. Work devastation, but okay, think of the data we could get. Oh shit. Oh fuck, you just slapped them. Steady on, are you alright? You never see that in Pokemon, you never see like people just physic like, physically assault each other. It's always like, oh, like, we'll have this screen, but we'll settle it with a Pokemon battle, and then when I lose, I'll just back off, fine, you know? Just what's going on around here? Even I, Tabitha, I'm feeling di all discombobulated. Leader Maxi, what are you trying to do to the world, to us, to Team Magma? This can never, ever be forgiven. Oh, I can't sneak by them. We're Team Magma. We appear whenever anything rare is found. Dear God, that was a slap. Could be worse. Lance ordered his dragon to smash Team Rocket Grunt through a wall. Did, did he? Oh, fuck, so he did. Like, I was, talk I was talking about this last time in my stream, and it was. We we're talking about Giovanni and how. and. I thought because we ran into Maxi, who's the leader of Team Magma, and we pointed out Giovanni is the Giovanni is basically this y Yakuza mafia boss who is absolutely fine with a little kid walking up, ruining everything, and just walking out instead of the kid just getting fucking stabbed or like shot or something like that, you know? Crash tried to give it an in kayfabe like, explanation about why Giovanni be like that. That's because Giovanni is your dad. That's also in our theory. Pokemon is one of those ones that always had a bunch of theories and a bunch of fucking, like, schoolyard rumours behind it, you know? Yes, man, there we go. I think seeing himself in red is probably the best one. That makes more sense. Right, so, Madison, so I never actually learned, and I've never bored to look. In school or I was always taught how to catch Reggie, like the Reggies. But my pals didn't want me to catch them because they wanted it to be special that they caught them. How the fuck do you catch Reggie, the Reggies, like Reggie Steel, Reggie Rock, and all that? That'd be good, some good writing to him if they'd done that. Instead of him just going, well, you beat me, kid, that's it. Can't, I'm giving up. My criminal empire is over. Chopper's evolving. Yes, man.
<laughs> this man, Chopper's turned into Machoke. Big, my big boy. Look at him. He's beautiful. But they're gonna stay in their awkward second form for so long. Right. Uh, how's the health looking? Health looking absolutely fine. Huh? What's a kid doing here? Go back. Shit. Maybe I shouldn't have sent uh, my boy out. Big Reginald can't do much against a flying Pokemon. I'll need, I'll need to get him a fucking other move. Confused? No, fuck. Right, we'll trade Reg Reginald out for... Uh, I don't want to give... I can't remember if Poison's weak. I think Blue was worse. He walked a, t into a terrorist incident headed by Giovanni because he, he knew you'd be a good two-shoes and show up. Just so you can see where you were at and peace out without helping the situation. Yeah, what if you never turned up? He didn't really think that through, did he? Or what if you never made it past the, you know, I'm doing air quotations here, but highly trained gang members in, you know, Team Rocket? I always remember there was a po I bought this Pokemon manga when I was a kid. Before I really knew what manga was, it was Pokemon Adventures, I think, and it was Star and Red. And they had a very different team. And I remember Team Rocket were made to be threatening. But it wasn't like Jesse and James, it was like Rocket Grunts and they were made to actually be kind of threatening. And I always found it really weird from like the cartoon where Jesse and James are the, you know, like Bulk and Skull. But, you know, but a cool guy in the mouth, you know. Even though Jesse's meant to be about 25 or something like that. The next one's still an Iron Tail. Uh... Oh, I heard the Pokemon mangas. It's... I've not read any more of it. I read it as a kid and I remember it being a bit darker than the actual show. But, uh... I seem to remember it is a bit darker. I've heard, like, I watched a video recently and it was, like, all the things that differ between Pokemon and, you know, the manga. Shit, I probably should have healed up, shouldn't I? Oh, well. Hey, Tabitha. Aha! One of my fans. You're the same kid that's always popping up. I can't believe you're even following me around in my private life. Ha, huh? well that's alright. Maybe I'll just clear up this instant, 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 intense, oh that's how we got, I couldn't say that. Maybe I'll just clear up this intensely unpleasant feeling I have well up inside me by beating you to a pulp. One then, Tabitha. I'll fucking smash you. Tabitha's only got a camera up. Right, so I don't know if my Earthquake will do much against that, but we can always try. Because I don't think that's got any, like... That won't have any fight moves, and... Here we go, big Earthquake, let's go! Is it safe, use, safe using the Earthquake while on the top of a building? Probably not. Yes, man, big Reggie. Aha, aha! You go to the shop and actually buy new stuff now, like items and all that. Good grief, today has been absolutely nothing but stress. I can't take it, it's so unpleasant. You better listen, you stress inducing child. When Leader Max's plan is being executed, twilight will fall upon, upon the world. The primordial sea will be changed into desolate land. In other words, all life. Child, what do you think you can do in the face of that which is to come? I'm looking forward to seeing you rush into action. Ha 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 Leader should be heading for Mount Pyre, which means I. I guess we're going to Mount Pyre afterwards. Thank you, young one. You helped save us from quite a pinch. You okay there, mate? Haha, <laughs> truly was a slap in the face. Those thieves. What could they hope by, uh, what could they hope to gain by investigating the extreme weather patterns of thousands of years ago? Oh, but I'm forgetting myself. First, I must properly thank you for your help. It may seem an odd way of rewarding you, but please, take this Pokemon as my thanks. You can't carry a Pokemon with you currently. Why don't you come again when you've made space in your team? That's what the those ruffians were seeking. I want to know about the extreme weather conditions that ruled thousands of years ago. Because two of those super ancient Pokemon, one of the pair that was that legendary Pokemon we know is the mighty Groudon, my boy. Yes, man. And by absorbing the energy that abounds in the natural world, Groudon transformed itself, or so it's said. 
To trans the transform good on caused so much disturbance uh, to the weather patterns that the world grew barren. The heat that dr dried up the oceans and the patched uh, land covered more and more of the planet. We refer to this transformation as primal reversion. And uh, the result of this is a terror we call primal Groudon. Primal uh, reversion is a possible form of evolution, like and yet not like mega evolution. So it's been theorised, but it's never been achieved by a Pokemon other than the super ancient legendary Pokemon. So it's been largely forgotten as a method of evolution. You'll excuse us then. We'll be heading downstairs now, but talk to us when you get a moment. We want to thank you as well. I'll go have a wee gab with them afterwards. Hey, Pilt. Hello. We've been saved by your actions, but I don't understand is what their team Magma was up to. Is it you? Talk to. Oh, he dropped by as you promised. Great. Please take this then. Here it is. A rocky helmet. A rocky helmet damages the attacker upon contact when the holder takes damage. At the time, I dared to uh, take a slap and that was totally on purpose. We know I shut down things regarding thousands of years ago, but I'm sure there won't be a problem. Oh, I got an icy rock. Oh, that's lovely. Yeah, they're talking about like, this big world-ending po Pokemon and they're like, oh, I'm sure it's not to worry about. I'm sure everyone's fine. Sure, you don't have to worry about big mega lava Godzilla. Fuck off, Brendan! Mikey, you've been looking for Pokemon here? Huh? That bracelet I've got on, like, it's like, I don't know, it's really cool. Whoa, so that's a mega bracelet, you can use it for mega evolution. So you'll just keep getting closer uh, to your Pokemon, get even stronger. Alright, I guess I've just got to help to test how strong you become, huh? Show me in battle how much better you've gotten. Come on, a battle. I'm challenging you to a battle. Fuck off, Brendan, I've not even got my full team. I like the battle theme, the rival battle on this. Like the theme's pretty cool. Slugma. Slugma what? Well, let's go. Here we go. Let's fucking drop Slugma. Fuck it. Straight away, earthquake. Now you just beat her in the bush. Set up a second grovel. Uh, fuck. I don't really have. Fuck it, that's what I'll send in Jet. Jet can take him on. Yeah, man. Fuck you. Imagine. Uh, ma imagine you've just been like, oh, I guess I'll fight my, one of my best pals and he whips out this fucking legendary Pokemon. Let's fucking go. Can't believe I said, yeah, man. I meant to say yes, man. Yeah, man, sounds fucking weird. Here we go, Mega Evolve fucking Jet, let's go! And whatever Luster purges, let's see what this does. Kinda wish the moves were like... Wait, at least in Dynamax, the moves get turned into like mega versions of the moves as well, you know? Instead of just more health and more attack and bigger stats, you know? Wilmer. Aquadug, there we go. Send in Aquadug to take on the Wilmer. Wilmer's gonna have so much health. Oh, he's not evolved yet. Right, Ice Fang, here we go. Avoid. How can it avoid the attack when you're starting to remind me of a certain trainer in Padilla? And that's not a good road to go down with. Brendan just not fuck off the whole thing. Ah! It's not very effective, but it's okay, he's been frozen. Yes, man! What are the best rivals in the series? I'm trying, I really like the one in 2, or the one in Gen 2. Uh, gold, I think his name is. And you know what? I like Marnie. I think Marnie was pretty cool. Sheesh, Mikey, you've got pretty darn decent. Yeah, fuck you, Brendan. 
I'd say you're good enough to search for Pokemon anywhere by now. Here, I'll give this to you so you can try it out. You should be able to use it fine. Or oh, give us Fly. Well, I guess you need to thank him for something then. My Fly, your Pokemon can carry you to back just about any place you've visited before. Of course, you'll need four tree gym badge first though. Well, I'm gonna go ahead. I'm definitely winning next time. Fuck off, Brendan. Thank you for the TM, but fuck off. It was down here. Right, I remember that's where you can catch a certain Pokemon, I think. What's up with Gander? Is it in here? I seem to remember. Oh, if you get Waterfall, you can go up there, I see. Problems later on rivals are not really antagonistic to you, so they're really not the massive drivers uh, of getting better as they used to be. Aye, nothing. It's not really like. They become more like friendly rivals, like. I think it's only done, been done one, like, well, once or twice, you know? I've heard the new one's pretty good, the new uh, rival. But I've not played Scarlet or Violet yet. I've got them, uh, well, I'm getting them for Christmas, I think. Wink, wink, you know? I've not got any. Fuck, uh. I've not got any Pokeballs, I forgot. Right, here we go. Hopefully this is Fortree City. Oh wait, no, it's a wee bit more. New Revel's nice, they got a bit of a personality uh, more than just friend. Yeah, I didn't like, oh... Uh, I forget his name, I like Marnie. Marnie was cool in Sword and Shield. But I can't, is it Hop? I didn't like Hop. Hop was annoying. To lurk in shadows and live in darkness, that is my destiny. I emerge to challenge you. Ninja Boy Yasu. Set so Ninjask. I really like. What's oh, not the other form? What's the other form of Ninjask called? Where well, it's got like one HP. Not one HP, it's got very low HP, I think, but it's, that's really cool. I forget his name. Yes, man, there we go. Shed Ninja, that's cool. I like Shed Ninja. Oh, I can't jump over that. That's us in Fort Free City. Let's go, we're doing for time wise. Oh, yeah, we can take on the gym. And then we'll hit up Mount Pyre next turn. How many gym badges we got? Actually, what we'll do first off... Right, how many gym badges have we got? Right, so if I get... Because I, like I like to do two gym badges a stream. So if I get the flying one, this one, and then I'll have... And then what I'll do is I'll... Oh yeah, because I catch Groudon before the final gym. Right, and then what we'll do... Organized boxes, and we will put not Aquadog, Aquadog, good. Uh, no, we'll put Jet in. Uh, what's the egg summary? On the summary on the egg, it'll take a long time to hatch. Well, you know what? We'll put we'll put you in the. We'll put you away for now. Uh, we'll get revenge out. And then we'll use, we'll use the Pokemon Center. Go on, Nurse Joy, on you go, pal. I love how that became a running joke about the Nurse Joy and Officer Jenny. Because you only had this, you can only fit like one model in the game. Oh, I forgot to put uh, someone back in, didn't I? Withdraw Pokemon. Who will I withdraw? In fact, Shed Ninja's the only Pokemon whose stats have ever been lower than its pre-evolved form. Oh, that's pretty cool. Oh, Duracell. I forgot to bring Duracell back out. Duracell's gonna be a fucking killer this gym. That's, uh, Shed Ninja's very much like a gimmick Pokemon, isn't it? Like, 
I was always really interesting. Not particularly good, but like, I've not really, like... The game where I play Pokemon, I'm not playing it for, like... Competitive Edge, you know? Secret Power Double Team. A Smackdown. User throws a stone or with projectile uh, to attack a bone. A flying Pokemon will fall to the ground. Like, oh, fuck, right, we're getting Smackdown, we're giving that to Reginald. Yeah, it can't take damage except from anything that's not super effective, but it'll die in one hit otherwise. Ah, that's pretty cool. And we'll do... We'll get rid of Rock Blast. Rock Blast is pretty... is pretty poopy. It can hit for like five things, but it's... So we start off everyone with Smackdown, Fly Drop... Uh... Nature Power, what's that? Attack of... Eh. Sandstorm, Toxic. Everyone can learn Toxic, holy shit. Even my wee fuck. So Toxic suggests that they have some sort of poison glands. Why does Minon have a poison gland? Vitality. Right, so we should be okay. And we'll save because we've actually made a lot of progress. Because if I crash, I'm going to have a wee cry. We've made it so far. Oh, there we go. The city's homes are built on trees. Perhaps uh, because of lifestyle, everyone seems healthy and lively. Why, even I do. I feel as if I've grown 30 years younger since I moved here. Yeah, but it's not wheelchair accessible, is it, in the slightest? Four Tree City. The tree chop city that frolics with nature. What's the ranger person saying? Some Pokemon evolve when you link trade them with friends. I know, I've got two of them. Living on top of trees is fine, but sometimes bug Pokemon coming through the windows. From Generation 5 onwards, if a Shin Ninja is sturdy, it can survive any damaging move or confusion damage an indefinite number of times. That sounds broken away. I, that sounds fucked. Like... <laughs> Holy shit, that's... Pretty fucking OP. Pokemon and people have adapted uh, to, with nature to survive. No need to make nature conform the way we want to live. I agree. The tree houses of Four Tree are great. I think it's the number one town for living together with Pokemon. I want to see more people. I know you see it occasionally. Like, I want to see. Like, I know you see that in uh, you see it in Sword and Shield, and you see it in this as well when you're starting off. I want to see just people living their lives with Pokemon as like pets, as as a gym. That's a cool wee gym. I like it. I really like to play Arceus. Arceus is on the list to play. Because I, I was watching it, uh, it very much looked like when I was a kid, that's what I'd see in my head when I was playing Pokemon, yeah. And we're going by, go by 11 Great Balls. Oh, I got a wee Premier Ball, just look at that. Nope, nope, fuck, I forgot we're going by. How much? That's double the price, so I'll buy 21 Hyper Potions. Buy five full restores. And I've already got full heals. Uh, repels, uh, repels aren't super... I used to use them a lot as a kid because obviously you know, they annoy you, but now I can just get easy XP by wiping at baby Pokemon. Oh, there's Big Sven down there. What's this? Oh, that's the base building. We're just going to run away from them quickly because I don't want to do the base building stuff. The ground absorbs rainwater and the trees grow by drinking that water. Where four trees city exists uh, to our both having earth and water. Hmm. What's the little Pokemon we found up on Route 120? I will go to the Fortree Gym, but something's blocking the way. After all, the bother I went through to train my Pokemon in Route 1 2. Let's have a wee gander up here. So there's a Pokemon blocking the way. You uh, smell singed. We have a volcano or something. Funnily enough, I remember one of the just one of these paths has Psychic or something that way. There's an invisible obstacle on your way. Oh. 
There's a Kekle on, isn't it? What's that you have for there? What's oh, called a Pokedex? It's really awesome. I'm seeing your Pokedex just remind me of something. I met a stream of Steven when I was searching for rare stones. Who boy had some amazing Pokemon with him. They weren't just rare, they were trained to terrifying extremes. He might even be stronger than the gym leader in this town. Right, uh. Let's go ahead down this way. Because we've seen Big, Big Sven heading up here. Hopefully, he's a way to get rid of his Kecleon. Why am I carrying this parasol? I'll tell you if you win against me. Is the answer because it's raining? I need to be careful with. Especially Golden. Like, if I don't take it at one shot, this thing could. Do a lot of damage. It's okay, we're 10 levels above it. Earthquake, just no fucking about. Right, and what else you got? A Sea King. I actually prefer Goldeen, like, look wise, to Sea King. I think Revenge is up level 38. Yes, man. Does Revenge evolve or is it only by Leafstone? Or am I making it up that they evolve at all? What have we got? A Kecleon. I fucking love Kecleon. They're pretty cool. Look at that. I like chameleons. Chameleons are really cool in real life. Smackdown, let's see what this animation looks like. Gekulon transformed into a rock type. That's a cool gimmick it's got. So it changes its type depending on what hits it. That's not a sort of gimmick Pokemon that I don't think is super good, but it's just like fun and interesting here. Yeah. Hey, where's Sven? Where'd he go? Let's try and sneak up on this Pokemon. Ah, ah damn it, I went too fast. Nope, I would not like to surf. Right, he's on that bridge. Got a nest ball. How do I get up on that bridge? Oh, a cave. What's in the cave? Scorched slab. A sunny day. I've got a feeling that I need flash to go down there, don't I? Who needs Flash? What have we got? What's up here in here? A Golbat? Oh! And try and catch Golbat like Golbat. Smackdown. And then we'll hit it with Magnitude. Oh, now we the one shot killed it. Yes, man. Reginald wants to have an explosion. Nope, that's like self-destruct. Absolutely not, Reginald. I'm guys to go a bit deeper than I'm meant to and just go into like an endgame section, aren't I? Where are we where are we off to now? 
Oops, I was checked. My phone just popped, uh, started. There we go. So I was waiting. I was seeing a message. I was wait, uh, checking it. I might just use an escape rope and just end up. Yeah, fuck. I'm just going to head back. Where is a deep, deep blue? Would you like to surf? Yes. Hopefully, this is the way out. Yes, man. There we go. All right, let's back to, get back to finding Sven. Shoulder is very, very lost. Fuck Horde of Oddish. Uh, earthquake take care of all the Oddish. Let's go. Right, and... Oh, there's the... There's the Let's fight this person. I need that little bit of training I need, I need to get in before the the gym. Birdkeeper Robert. Oh, fuck Swablu. That's what I've got to worry about. Not so much this one, it's the Evolt. It's Big Old Terrier, the Evolt form I've got to worry about. Right, what I'll do is I'll smack down, cunt it where we rock. We pebble square to the face. Holy shit, is it... Is it super effective against flying types? Like specifically that move, or it seems to be doing really well. You and your Pokemon were stronger. We were, yes, man. Right, here we go. It's big Sven. Here he is. Hmm. Mikey, so we meet again. How has it been? Have you been using the Mega Bracelet wisely? I suppose I needn't ask, though. Not when it comes to you and your team. I wonder, have you noticed him? There's something here you can't see. Now, if I use this device on the invisible obstacle, invisible obstacle, I couldn't dock there. No bar in describing it, I should just show you. That'd be more entertaining. Mikey, are you and your Pokemon ready for battle? Yes. Good. In that case, I want you to take this. Try on, I'm sure it'll fit you. It's a wee Kekle on, isn't it? Put a Devon scope on. A previously invisible Pokemon became visible to you, the naked eye. The Pokemon attacked. Oh no. And we're trying to catch this Kecleon. I'm going to probably end up killing it by accident, but... Oh well, level 30, let's go. Smackdown. And here we go, bag. So when I was a kid and I played through Ruby, Kecleon was my boy. For some reason I basically adopted this Pokemon as my main. I had like Kecleon, Groudon, Flygon, and a Grovel. Not Grovel, uh, whatever Grovel's final form is. I got a Kecleon, yes man. What we calling Kecleon? What we calling a good chameleon? Kecleon, the colour swap Pokemon. Kecleon is capable of changing its body colours at will to blend in with its surroundings. There's one exception, this Pokemon can't change the zigzag pattern on its belly. I think we'll call it uh, Karma. You, you, you may be able to hear my dog going mental barking in the background. Because how dare other people live in this building? How fucking dare they? Karma Chameleon's been added to the substitutes. Just as I expected. It's called the Devon Scope. It's a fantastic piece of tech that lets you see Pokemon in hiding. Consider it a gift from me. Take it. And we'll never use it again apart from uh, this one outside the gym. And one more thing. No, Pat. Don't. Don't rub it in. Don't rub it in. Buddy's dead. Buddy's no coming back. We can't get Swampert. 
this stone ranks as one of my top five favourite stones in existence. I have no doubt your Pokemon will like it too. Well, he would have if he survived this long. But thanks, Steven. Thanks for bringing that up. You know, Mikey, I like to see trainers and Pokemon trying their best. That's why I like you so much. Hmm? Seen no something just shone for a moment in your bag. I'm sure I sense the power of some kind of stone. A meteorite? No, it couldn't be. Let's meet again someday. And there we go, because Steven's, you know, just so rudely brought it up. I just put it up, map. that's the Pokemon I've lost. In fact, we have lost one more today, and, uh, uh, Gulp and Come, the, the swall Swallow, we lost Buddy, the Marsh Stomp, Nut, the Nuzle Nuzleaf, Skitty, or oh, Punchy, the Skitty, Cooper, the Zigzagoon, Rocky, the Geodude, and Anxiety, the Loudred. In fact, we had quite a badge, and that was all from the Winstrut estate. Those bastards. Right, here we go, let's... So let's get ready, we're going to head back to the... Actually, what I'm going to do, I'm going to do it. We're going to head back to the Pokemon uh, Center. We're going to heal up. We're going to take on the Kecleon. And then we're going to go take on the gym. Fuck off! No! I should just use Magnitude or some of that. Right, come on, Reginald, you can do this. Yes, man! Why Why do you wear a parasol? I don't think Strong Sunlight is good for my Pokemon, so I shield them with my parasol. Okay. I know it's not a hot take, but god, the po music in this game is very good. I think it's Pokemon. The music's always really good in Pokemon games. I shall go fight. I'll fight the Kekalon first. Because the Kekalon aren't super strong, and I should be able to kill it in like two hits or so. So I'll just take on the Kekalon now. Whereabouts is it? It's here and down the way, isn't it? Use the Devon Scope? Yes. Oh, there we go. Previously invisible Kecleon became visible to naked eye. The Kecleon fled. Oh, it ran away. That's much easier. Wait, there's a TM up there at the back. What is it? Grass knot. Can't remember what grass knot does or if it's any good. But anyway, we're going to run back to the Pokemon Center, just so we're fully prepared. Right, here we go, let's get ready. Oh, my mouse just dropped there. Right. Here we go. Fully, we're all ready. We're all jacked up. We're ready to go. We've got a count. We've got at least two counters to the flying type, and then we've got a big counter to Alteria and Gyarados or Aquadug. So hopefully we're not going to lose any boys because Alteria is the biggest uh, risk we've got in this stream coming up. She's famous for wiping teams uh, if she starts stacking our fucking sword dance. Yo, how's it going champ to be Mikey? Poor tree gym master Winoa is a master of flying type Pokemon. She's waiting at the back of this gym behind the rotating doors. Waiting on new challengers who are uh, trying to take wing. Okay, go for it. Right, what's the gimmick of this one? It's the... We hold the elegant battle style of bird Pokemon. Bird Keeper Jared. So, get rid of the RIP section there. Fucking Jared, let's go. What's your character to Alteria? I've got a Gyarados with a Ice Fang, which hopefully should be able to uh, do, like, put a dent in the dragon side of it. Smackdown, that's what I was looking for. We have to, hopefully, I've got some PP items. Should be a one shot then, hopefully. 
because Altera is the one I'm really worried about. Because if I remember from playing Ruby last time, or I know this one's slightly different, uh, I need to worry about Altera, his, her Altera, I need to worry about one of the guys in Elite Fours. Uh, what's the Pokemon that's like a big fucking... Uh, it's like a walrus. Is it Walrin? Is that what it's called? I need to worry about that. And since it's been hit with Smackdown, I can then hit it with ground moves. Yes, man. Yes, man. Fuck you, Jared. You're, you're strong. I'm damn right, um, Jared. Right, uh. I need to go this way, don't I? Oh, I've completely... I need to go back again. Damn it, I thought I could sneak by them a second time. Well, no, I taught me personally. You can't beat me easily. Watch me destroy her easily. Big Ky Kylie? Swablu. I, I like Swablu. Swablu's a cool Pokemon. Gen 3 had some really cool new Pokemon. How many Pokemon are we at now? We've got to be pushing a thousand odd. I was beaten. Yes, you were. Yes, man. Right. So I'm not going down that. I'm going up this way. Cool. There's no need for Winoa or Gym Leader to deal with you. I'm plenty good enough for you. Are you, pal? Big camper. Tyrell? Tyrell? That's it, yeah. Oh, Dodo's such a cool Pokemon, I really like it. I remember I always had a move in uh, Gold, Silver and Crystal. I used to always just go Tri-Attack. I don't know if it's actually useful at all or not. If you're not flying, so Magnus should be able to just catch you. Doesn't affect the Dodo. Oh, I see. I wasn't as into its evolved form. I don't know why. I think it's much cuter as just the, you know, the two-headed Pokemon. The evolved form's obviously stronger, but I just preferred the first version. Hi, Megan. How you doing? Pelipper. Cool. Easy peasy. Reginald can take out all these ones. We just keep hitting Smackdown. Let's do Protect. I'm just doing this gym, and then uh, that's me. To do protect two times in a row. Yes, man, here we go. Big Reginald taking names and wiping teams. Yes, man. Revenge go to level 39. You know what? We've not lost my Pokemon as I thought we would. Lovers of bird Pokemon aspire to join this gym. As a member of a 4 tree gym, I'm not allowed to lose. The drill. Oh, it's the evolved form. Again, it's not as cute. Do do oh, how do you, I can't I can't remember you say its name, but that's much cuter. Try attack. Oh here we go, try attack. Not very effective. Yes, man! Reginald is unstoppable. So what what are you playing, Megan? Anyway, I think I've skipped him. Okay. Don't turn round, don't turn... Yes, man. Still playing Subnautica. Glad I went home for a bit. Right, PP up. We'll do PP up on Reggie, and we'll do it on Smackdown. Get Reggie's PP up. Uh... You know what, we'll give him a wee treat with some moomoo milk. There we go. Get glugging that milk. Right, Reggie, come on, let's take her up. Let's take on. Uh, I forgot her name. I'm Winona. Winona, the leader of Four Tree Pokemon Gym. 
I have become one with bird Pokemon and I have sword disguise. However grueling the battle, we will triumph with grace. Witness the elegant choreography of my bird Pokemon and me. Right, here we go. Here we go, right. Versus is Benoit, right. Let's go, don't bring out your Altaria. Right, swell out, it's easy, I just need to hit. Just need to hit Smackdown, then that should be it. Right, Smackdown, here we go. It's okay, Reginald is so fucking beefy, not much can actually happen to him. Yeah, that swallow down. Send in Pelipper. You know what? We'll trade out. Uh, let's get Duracell in there to take on Pelipper. Right, come on, Duracell. We can do this. We can do this. Uh, Electro Ball. Shit, it's protected itself. So that won't hit. Right, come on, Duracell, come on. There we go. Super effective. I think it should be doubly effective because it's a water flying type. So, yes, man. Altaria, right, here we go. Here we go. It's fucking Altaria. Get what Aqua dug in there. This is the one I was worried about. Sitting in Altaria. Right, uh, Ice Fang. Come on. Oh, thank fuck. Oh. Oh. It's not Skarmory. Who? Fuck it. Aqueduct can take it, Skarmory. I was wrong to be scared of Altaria. We just one shot at Altaria. Yes, man. And that's our strongest Pokemon, so we don't have to. Oh, fuck. Oh no! Oh, it's okay. I've done no damage. I was wrong to be worried. We're okay. I think we are super leveled, so nothing can really, you know, stop us now. Yes, man. Aqua to go to level forty-one. Wants to learn Crunch. Uh, I think we're good. Keep old moves. Give up on crunch, yeah. Chopper go to level 32. Ah, Chopper can start getting into fights now. Same with Rex. Never before have I seen a trainer command Pokemon with more grace than I. Yes, man. Fuck you, Winoa. I recognize your talent and present you with this gym badge. Yes, man. I'm the fucking best. Make you receive the Feather Badge from Winoa. All Pokemon to level 70, even those that receive two trades will obey your command. You should be able to use Fly outside the battle and take this, a gift from me. I got the, I got Roost, ooh. Roost. With this move, user can restore its HP up to half of its max by landing on the ground and restore, resting its injured body. However, the user u loses its Flying type designation during a turn, so be, care, be cautious. You won against me, I know you'll keep aiming higher and higher. I just, keep, I just hit my headset off of the wall, so sorry if you heard that. Someday, you may even fly up to the sky. I get that impression from you. Yes, man. Six badges down. Let's have a look. How many badges? Not options. Six badges down. Two to go. We can fucking do this. Because if we do... Next stream, we do... The next two, well, say if we do, say we do next stream, we do the next gym badge and Groudon. Then after that, we do the final gym badge and Victory Road. Then we do Elite Four. Yeah, we can be finished this in like five, like, we can do this in like four, three or four streams. This is doable. And then do we just carry on to the next? So that's quite a wee bit off. And we're... I haven't been going on for a wee bit, so I think we're just going to head back to the Pokemon Center and rest up. 
because our boys have deserved the rest, because they've been through hell. We've beaten our old dad, we had the wee trip in the desert, oh fuck, I've wandered down here again. We battered Team Magma in the Whittler Tower, and then we battered Winoa from the uh, Wind Gym, so your old dad's laughing, and we've evolved, we've evolved quite a few of our boys. Chopper has became, Chopper's become a man, uh, and I... We're in a good place with boys right now. We actually we lost uh, Gulp and Come. But that wasn't like a... Out of all the boys I would have uh, lost, he's the one that I'm the least broken up about. But anyway, but I'll need to work on the wee memorial picture and get that updated, which I'll put that up. I'll put that up in the meantime. Let me just put that on. Bye, boys. He's... Uh, in, mem in memory of those we've lost. You know, but we go up and come. So I, I'm still fucking loving playing this. Uh, we've actually been doing quite really well. We've done a lot more than I thought we would. Uh, will, we be, will we be streaming it tomorrow? We might. We might. We're streaming uh, later on on Sunday. I don't quite know what we're streaming yet. Sorry, that's a Professor Layton. So you have to catch up on my Twitter and my Discord to you know see what I'm thinking about then. But aye, thank you so much for joining us, boys. Just let me try, uh, just check if anyone else is on. Uh, we will be... No one's on the now. Saturday, Saturday night's pretty quiet. But anyway, boys, uh, thank you so much for joining us. Uh, let me just transfer over to this screen. And let me just transfer... Let me just pause this and get some music on the go. There we are, and... There we go, boys. So thank you so much for joining us. Uh, as usual, I've been Mikey. You guys have been absolutely wonderful. Hopefully I'll catch you in the next stream. But until then, boys, have a good day. Have a really good week. But most importantly, boys, have good mental health. Look after, after yourself, boys, and we'll be back with Pokemon Omega Ruby next time. See yous!